In Philly, the police got up in a helicopter and they dropped C4 down, which is an explosive for y'all that don't know. They dropped down the explosives on this neighborhood. In this neighborhood, they evacuated the neighborhood first, but the only people that wouldn't evacuate was just people from this group called MOVE, M-O-V-E. Now, MOVE, they was like, um, they believed like they wanted to get back to the hunter-gatherer days. That's like the days back when you had to go out and kill your food. They was into stuff like that. They didn't like the industrial stuff. And um, I guess the whole setup of American capitalism and jobs and all that kind of stuff. They didn't, they didn't like that. They wanted to be more like, more like the animal days, man. Now, how they, why they believed in all that and all that, that don't matter how, you know, cause I almost even didn't want to talk about that. Cause the bottom line is no matter what they believed in, how does the police just bomb them? Like, like they the military and, and like, if you looked at this picture and didn't really pay no attention, you'd think this was Baghdad or something, man. This is in Philly, man, right here in America in the 1980s. In the 80s, man, the police dropped, uh, dropped bombs on the neighborhood. They left 250 people homeless and they killed 11 people, kids included, women included. That was, um, a part of that movement. It was only two survivors. And they ended up paying millions to the survivors and millions to the people who lost their homes and stuff. But man, just think about that. Just think about that, man. This is America, man. They dropped a bomb on their own people. Just because they had different religious or different cultural or whatever beliefs. Hey, man. Ain't nothing got to get, ain't nothing got to be done like that.